Hello everyone, welcome to another Namecheap tutorial. So in this tutorial, I will show you how to connect Namecheap domain to your uh, Wix. Um, and the first thing that you need to do is you need to go to your Namecheap and then you need to go to your domain list right here. Now here you will see all your domains. You need to click on the domain that you want to manage. So click on manage here. And then obviously here we will have a, a lot of different options, right? Uh, as you can see, we have name servers, so we need to use a custom DNS name servers. Here, we need to put name servers from Wix, right? So we need to put name servers from Wix. Now, what we can do is we can go here and uh, what we need to do is we need to basically go to our, uh, to check domain records, as you can see in your Wix, go to domains page in your Wix account, click the show more icon and then click manage DNS. Here, you will have manage DNS records you will put those records right here. So that's basically uh, the first thing. Then what you can also do is you can also go to advanced DNS, right? Uh, this is the second thing that you can do, right? Uh, and here what you can do is you can actually go and add a uh, records, right? Now these records can be also found in Wix. These are uh, basically called uh, host records, right? Host record section. You can also give, uh, you, you can also find these on Wix as well in the DNS section or in the name server section as well. Uh, and this is pretty much, uh, yeah, what you, what you will do and then just copy the Wix records here and then you will be able to connect your domain uh, to your uh, Wix account, right? Then what you need to do is just go back to your Wix account. You will need to verify the domain connection, right? Uh, and uh, point the domain, uh, point the, uh, yeah, the domain from Namecheap to, to Wix. Uh, and that's pretty much it. It's, it's really as easy as that. Obviously, if you have any questions, if you have any, um, you know, issues, then you should be able to contact either Namecheap support or, uh, you know, Wix support as well, because they do have great supports on either side of the end. So that's pretty much how it works. It's really simple. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.